Hello guys, this is Kevin on behalf of Simple Tech Reviewers. Today doing an unboxing on this MSI 760GM-P23FX Micro ATX motherboard. We have the box itself here. Uh, on the front we have uh, some advertisement here for the OC Genie for easy overclocking via the multiplier. We also have the MSI Core Unlock for a certain Phenom CPUs that have locked cores like the 3 core, like the X3 I know has an unlocked core that you can get to with a motherboard like this. You, you also have the lossless 24-bit audio as well as a free trial of Norton internet security. Oh, and it is, it's worth noting that this uses the AMD 760G chipset and supports also the Phenom 2 processors as well as the FX processor that I reviewed earlier. Uh, and you do need a BIOS update to use the AM3 Plus uh, CPUs. Okay, so there's no seal to break. Let's open it up. First thing we have here is the drivers and utility disk. I would highly recommend downloading the drivers from the official MSI website. Uh, the drivers are fine to use, but definitely the drivers for the sound and the chipset. Get that off the website. You get two SATA connectors, center SATA cables here. Just basic, uh, they're not the angled kind, they're just your basic three foot long SATA connectors. Get your IO shield plate here for your case. And a user guide here. That's also large, like the AMD user guide for the processor. And this one looks like it comes in. It looks like three dozen different languages with uh, instructions on how to install the CPU as well as the graphics card. Also, uh, installing the case switches. Underneath this cardboard here, we have the motherboard itself in this anti-static bag. Uh, I highly recommend touching some metal before you touch anything like this, so got that grounded. Pull this out for you guys. So this is a micro ATX motherboard, hence the small size and the limited amount of connectors. Uh, we got your PCI Express 2.0 slot there got your PCI Express one time slot there and you've got a regular PCI yeah, connector right there. Your 760G chipset lives under this heat sink here. Uh, looks like we have uh, active phase switching which uh, limits power to the CPU when, when it's not needed. There's your socket AM3 Plus for our FX processor we're about to install which is, by the way, I reviewed it already right here. You can check out our earlier video of it. We have two slots for DDR3 dual channel. We have a 24-pin motherboard connector right there for the main power. We have a 4-pin motherboard there for the CPU power. And it is good to note that these are all solid capacitors, so they're really high quality here. You don't have to worry about melting them for overclocking or whatnot. Oh, we have six SATA 3 connectors right here. Uh, these are for your front mount USB, front mount audio, front mount power and reset switch. And on the I.O. side of things, we have the integrated 760 chipset onboard graphics. You have your latency PS2 mouse and keyboard six USB 2.0 slots, no USB 3.0 sadly because it's a budget motherboard. We have your Ethernet 10 100 1000 connector right there and your 24-bit audio there. On the back you just got your AM socket AM3 plus mounting bracket there for aftermarket heatsink and fans. And that's about it. A really basic motherboard for my budget build. But yet it also has all the features of the more expensive motherboard, just in a smaller package. And I think that's it. There's nothing else in the box. And thanks for watching my unboxing video on the MSI 760GM motherboard. Uh, if you like this video, guys, please subscribe. 
And this is Kevin on behalf of Simple Tech Reviewers signing out. Thank you.